Alright, I'm gonna go through all this mail that I've been accumulating. The first one's from Pargon Sisto, which I think was the... This guy right here. He says, enjoy your new stronghold. He says, way to go. By now, I'm sure you've made good use of the essential furnishings provided when you purchase your stronghold. No, not really, because I can't figure out where that stuff went. But the place is probably still a little bare, right? That's why I've taken the liberty of setting you up with a personal vendor who specializes in stronghold merchandise. Oh, okay. Maybe you're thinking, I've got the basics, Pargon. Why would I need anything more? No, I don't have the basics. I can't figure it out. See, the more decorations and trophies you collect for your strongholds, the greater its prestige will be. Earn enough prestige and you can have your stronghold placed in the public listing. Let everyone know your stronghold is the best stronghold. Rub it in their faces. By the way, that annoying noise they need to fix, it's a... he's unlocking items, which is actually probably what I need to do also. It makes that awful noise. In fact, I bet you I need to eat those. And, um, people have already been saying that they need to turn that down. It's really annoying. Ugh. Really messes with my ears. Anyway, so now you know. Anyway, um, let everyone know your stronghold is the best stronghold. Rub it in their faces. In case you're away from home, you can also make purchases with decoration vendors on Carrick Station. You'll find them near blah blah blah. I'm in buying a stronghold. You may have just made the smartest move of your life. Now go make that. Stronghold of yours, the envy of all the galaxy. So it's very important. Make sure you don't delete that. Next. Aesthetic Consultant Katorna. Hi, I'm following up on your recent purchase of a stronghold with some hopefully helpful pointers for making your own decorations. Have you heard of fabrication droids? They're able to quickly manufacture polished decorations from prefabs that you provide them. There are two basic kinds of prefabs, synthetic and industrial. Synthetic prefabs can be crafted by anyone proficient in synth weaving, biochem, and artifice, while those familiar with armor, mech, arms tech, and cyber tech can craft industrial prefabs. All you need is the proper schematic, which you can learn from a crew skill trainer. Oh, I wish it would have told me all this before. And uh, the required quantity of crafting materials, you can also combine the basic synthetic and industrial prefabs into a universal prefab. Lots of decorations require universal prefabs, so it's a good idea to gaba 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 gaba. And she gives you the droids, which is very important. Make sure you don't delete the droids. Admiral Ego! Fleet Admiral Ego here, reaching out from the Kuat system. Words come up from Paragon Par, Paragon Sisto that you've got yourself a stronghold. Good. The more you build the more you build that thing up the better. Think of your stronghold as your power base for the Republic. The more you expand and build out your stronghold, the more your contributions will count as we engage the enemy in planetary conquest. Oh, so your stronghold's gonna help the conquest and that's how you help the personal conquest, okay. Your conquest objectives will change periodically, as will the rewards. Keep an eye out for notifications in your official mission log, and keep fighting the good fight. Bay one ago, first fleet. <gasps> first fleet, I'm pretty tired. So you get a lockbox. Contains material gathering decorations, which can be harvested for crafting materials. Cool. Captain Daruga, Guild Flagships. Hello, it's an honor to be writing you. Fleet Admiral Ego asked me to pass along an important addendum to his previous message. As part of our ongoing effort to prevail in planetary conquest, guilds across the galaxy have been authorized to register a flagship with the Republic. Guild Flagships will amplify contributions to planetary conquest and provide your guild with resource sharing and rapid deployments to a guildmate's position, among other benefits. If you haven't joined a guild, I highly recommend you do so. And if you do enjoy guild membership already, but your guild doesn't have a flagship, we hope you work together to make it happen soon. As long as it doesn't take 50 mil. Thank you for your time, Captain Wayne Daruga, Republic First Fleet. 
and you get some banners. Blonk, blonk, blonk. Okay, so that that is the mail. I wanted to do a video of just all that mail. So, thanks for watching, you guys, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.